Hi guys! Today I am doing a very exciting maternity haul. This is with Pink Blush Maternity. Um, I'm sure you guys know what Pink Blush is. It's like a very, very popular maternity brand. Um, they do also have clothes for non-maternity as well. The reason I'm doing this video is because I have seen so much of their stuff promoted to me on like Facebook and just been so like eager to try it. I thought it was so cute and a lot of it is very like wear before baby and after baby. There's so much cute stuff that I really, really, really loved. So I actually reached out to them to work together um, and they gifted me a couple of pieces to try on. So this is not sponsored, I'm not being paid to make this video, but I do make a commission through them if you shop through the links I provide, but you don't have to. I'm just so excited. I haven't tried anything on, which has been hard. I got it a few days ago, but I've been super busy. So I'm so excited to try everything on, um, see how it fits, see how it fits the bump, see if I think it'll work after labor, how, after labor, after the baby, um, and see, you know, how the quality is and all that stuff because Pink Blush is not the cheapest brand, I'm gonna be honest, and that's something that made it kind of hard for me to want to spend money just because usually maternity wear um, is temporary. You're not gonna wear it for a very, very long time, probably less than a year. So I did like that a lot of these pieces are appropriate for after baby as well. That makes them worth more because you can get more wear out of them. Um, and then also because the prices are more of like the mid to higher range, I want them to be good quality. So I am super excited. One thing I also wanna mention, I didn't know this until I actually got the items and looked to make sure they were the right things. Um, they all were, also came super quick, like super quick. I think I placed the order on a Monday and they came on a Wednesday, like beyond quick. I'm in New Jersey, if that makes a difference. But they do not, as far as I'm aware, have their own brand. It's more of like a, not a boutique, but like they have other brands that they sell. Um, so like it doesn't say pink blush on the tags, if that makes sense. But on the website, it doesn't say what the brand is, but on the tag it does. So just keep that in mind if there's like a specific brand that you were looking for. It doesn't say that on the website. So something funny happened um, in a good way, um, but we will talk about it when we get there. But I'm really excited to try everything out. So I think I got five things. I was going to get all dresses because I'm a crazy person and I love a good dress just because it's so easy one piece, but I got... I think it's a top. It's been a while, so I'm excited to be surprised. Um, but this is a try-on haul, of course. Um, just so you know, I am six months pregnant about, right? 23, 24 weeks. So I think that's six months, if my math is right. So the bump is not huge. It has lots of growing to do, but it's definitely there. I'm really excited. Let's get into it. So first we have this striped sweater dress, which I'm really excited about because I will be at my biggest um, in fall. So I wanted some things that weren't just summer, even though that's what we are in right now. I will also put in the picture from the website just so you can kind of see, you know, how it looks on the model versus a real pregnant lady. I don't know if they're pregnant, they could be. Anyway, this brand was one of the popular ones. I think a couple items I got was this brand called Laylee, Laylee, Laylees. I'm not sure. This feels really nice. So I got this in a small. That is one thing I do not mention lately being pregnant. I've been wearing mostly mediums in like standard sizes, sometimes large, but um, mostly mediums have been fitting me. Some smalls have depending on like the stretch and stuff, but I got all of this in a small based on the size chart on the website um, and just based on like what the models were wearing and stuff like that because I am normally a small um, before pregnancy. So I figure if these clothes are meant for pregnancy, I should still be a small we will see this is super cute i love the colors so it's just a simple like straightforward sweater dress but the colors are like the cutest thing it's very thin which i like it's not not very thin in like a bad way but it's thin enough that you're not gonna like sweat to death which is always a fear of mine the stitching is actually really nice um it's really soft and it's not too short from what I can tell. I'm really excited. My only fear just holding it up is that the sleeve area is going to be a little big and you might see the bra under here. But let's see. I'm going to put it on. It's super cute and it fits actually really well. It doesn't feel too tight at all. But it's shorter than I expected. Um, I am a 5'4", five, 5'5", five, five, depending on the day, you know. But it's a little bit shorter. Like if I bend over, you can, you know, see stuff. But it is stretchy and it's definitely cute on the bump. I do like that. It's just shorter than I expected. Like it is, you know, get in trouble at high school. Kind of short, right at the fingertips. But other than that, I really like it. I mean, I guess I could wear like shorts under it or like more 
coverage underwear. I don't know. I think it's adorable. I mean, I love the colors. I am, if you care, I'm a light, no, I'm a soft summer. And I feel like these colors just scream soft summer. Lots of like, not necessarily pale, but like cooler tones. It has like a little yellow though and some peach. I really love the colors. If this was like a top, I would even be more excited about it. I do love a, like a, like a dress like this just because it's easy throw it on and I definitely will wear this. I think the colors really suit me. The, the length is the only thing that is a little bit concerning. So I do have a long torso to keep that in mind. If you're shorter or if even if you're my height, you have a shorter torso and like longer legs, it may not be as short on you. I love it. I do. It's really good quality. You're not seeing the bra here, so that's great. And I just, it's really comfortable. It's not itchy, which is nice because a lot of sweater dresses can definitely have that like itchiness to them. But I really like it. I'm so happy. Okay, we're starting with a good grade, y'all. Why did I say y'all? Don't know. We're off to a good start. Okay, next up, this dress is less my style than anything else it's not something i normally go for but i really thought it was super cute on the model and i feel like it's super super airy and awesome for like around the house looks like this it's a little shapeless and like i don't say moo mooey because it's not but it is very like flowy um my only fear of this one that i that i considered was that the boob area might be too small i don't know that's really supposed to fit like under your boobs like the seam but we'll see. I really love the color. I feel like this color looks really nice on me. It's like a cool toned reddish maroon. Am I wrong? I don't know. But I really love like the, I don't want to describe the fabric wrong, but it feels gauzy, but in a good way. Does that make sense? Like that, that summer lightweight airy material, but the boob area is double lined. So if you didn't want to wear a bra, you could. Um, I don't know about that for me, just simply because I have grown. <laughs> um, it is really elasticy and stretchy, which is awesome. Even around the bust area it is. But otherwise, other than the boob area, it's not double lined. So I do fear it's a little bit see-through, just I'm in front of the window now. It's a little bit see-through. Um, so maybe just like nude underwear is the answer. This brand is called Shop Neighbor. It says buy in the beginning. But let's try it on. I'm really excited about the color. I love the color from this here. It looks good. I like it. Couple of issues, just a few. Um, I wish I hate to say because it feels really nice and lightweight and comfortable. Okay, first issue. We have a lot of like loose strings happening. Um, I definitely look pregnant in this. Not that I didn't look pregnant in the last one, but this dress makes me look pregnant <laughs> do you know what I mean um if you're pregnant you know what I mean my issue is really the neckline and like the elastic I don't know what's happening back here but it's like this should be higher or lower so right now the way it's fitting is very moo mooey it's very very short more of like a pajama around the house thing because here is the seam right here um and I do think that might be how it's supposed to fit I will put in like I said the picture on the website if I pull it down where I feel like maybe it should be. So like I pull the back up a little and I pull the front down underneath my boobs. Um, you do have to wear something here because if I didn't, it would be a show for everyone. So that makes it longer in the front, which is nice, but it makes it a little shorter in the back, which honestly, it's still a bit longer than the last one. So that's fine. And I probably would wear it more likely with the seam like under, but the problem is because it's so stretchy, it doesn't stay. Like my boobs are very large right now and it's like not staying under here and I got a small. So like I try to pull it up and like readjust. It definitely needs like some adjustment. A white little bra or something here would definitely be cute. It's cute. Like I 100% think it's cute. I think it's comfortable. This stretchy arm thing, like little poofies. So, so, so cute. Um, not too tight on the arm either. My only discomfort is like this, the elastic here on the shoulders feels like a little tight and like weird. Like. Just like it needs to be higher or lower. Like maybe this neck hole in the back needs to be adjusted or I almost want to like pull on the elastic and like stretch it out a little. Does that make sense? It's so cute though. If you have smaller breasts, this may be more for you. But I really love the, um, the print. It's like little star flowers or something. I don't know. I feel so pregnant and like in a field. Do you know what I mean? <laughs> Like, this dress makes me feel like I'm in a maternity photo shoot. <laughs> so, um, 
Yeah, this, I've, I haven't, I don't know that I've looked more pregnant than in this moment. Okay, now this is the one with the funny story and I'm so excited about it. So this is just a striped like midi dress. Seems pretty simple, but <laughs> I purchased secondhand a dress that looks just like this in a maroon and, and white stripe. I wear it all the time. It's one of my favorite things. It fits so well. It accentuates the bump, but not in like a weird way. It's stretchy, but not too thin. It, you don't need a bra. It's just my favorite thing. I've been looking for another, like the same dress in another color, um, just because it's like something I want to wear a lot, like multiples. I can totally wear it, not pregnant as well. I had it in a size small. I absolutely was obsessed with it. And it's the brand Heart and Hips. And I was looking that all over the internet and I like, couldn't find it anywhere. And then I ordered this dress from Pink Blush. Didn't know it was the brand Heart and Hips. Just thought it looked similar to the one I have that I really love. So I want to get it. It's the same dress. It's the same. So here's the one I have. It's the same dress. It's the same. It's the same material. It's the same size. It's the same, like, it's the same dress. It's just black and white instead of maroon and white or red and brown or whatever you want to call the one I have. But it has this amazing slit in the leg, which is necessary when you're wearing a midi or maxi dress. It's just necessary because walking is a thing. But I'm so excited to put this on. I, when I got this in the mail and I just saw the brand Heart and Hips, I was like, you're joking. That's where this is from? Oh my God. I had no idea. Cause when I bought that dress secondhand, I didn't know it was a maternity dress. I thought it was just like a dress. <laughs> And then it like fit. I don't know. I don't know. But I'm so excited about this one. This one, like really, like as soon as I opened the package, I was like, what? So exciting. So let's put it on and show you. Hopefully it fits the same. I don't see why it wouldn't. But um, again, all this stuff is a small. So let's keep going. Okay, so this is it. And it's a little bit tighter than the one I have, I think. But I think it's just because this is brand new. And that's why. Like the other one is like stretched out and worn, washed, all that stuff. But it literally fits almost the same. It was a little harder to get, <laughs> to pull it on. Um, but it is really stretchy, but it's like snug as well. That's why you don't have to wear a bra with it. Like I feel fully supported. The only issue with this is there's no adjustable straps, which is actually fine for me. It fits me perfectly. But if you tend to have to adjust the straps, that may be an issue, but it's lined um, up until about here. So it has like a double lining in it, which is nice. So you don't really see the underwear as much. I mean, a little, but honestly, who cares? But this is like my, my like, I love that. Like. It's so cute. I love it. This is something I'll definitely be wearing. But I am obsessed with this. I probably need to stretch it out a little, wear it a few times, like do some movement um, to make it as comfy as the other one. But it's literally the same dress and I'm so excited about this. Like I, I'm so happy. Um, next I have a pair of shorts and a shirt. They don't go together, but we might just end up wearing them together because that's the name of the game. Or I might try to do something else. I don't know. We'll see. Okay, next we have these linen shorts. They are the brand Laylee again, size small. I'm a little nervous they're gonna be tight. Brown, they have pockets. I thought they were really cute on the model, so let's hope that they, they work out. Okay, I think these are pretty cute. Definitely not that, the best outfit to wear. I just, I mean, this obviously is just, uh, it is what it is, but it fits the bump, like on the bump. Like most of the time when I wear shorts now, I have to like <sighs> do that. Um, or like all the way up, um, but like right on the bump they fit, they're not like pressing or pushing at the moment. Like I said, I'm six months, so that could stop eventually. They actually are really nice. I actually really like them a lot. They definitely aren't doing much for my flat pancake butt, but what are you gonna do? That's just what happens when you have a flat pancake butt. But I really like them, especially how they look from the front. I think that it's it's awesome, actually. I really, really like them a lot. I just don't know how I'm gonna style them. That's a problem for me to figure out as I live my life. I do think that they will be good after pregnancy as well. Pretty much everything so far has been an A plus for after pregnancy. What do we think? I know there's like a wrinkle, but do we like them? What's so great about shorts and pregnancy is that when you go to the doctor, you can't wear a dress because they have to just do the Doppler and you just have to like pull this down. Um, so that's why it's great to have a short. I lied. I lied. The last item is medium. <laughs> they didn't have small. 
Um, so I ordered medium, which is fine because sometimes medium fits too. And it's just a shirt, so I feel like it'll definitely fit after baby. It is the brand Wishlist. It's simple. It's a black tank top with white straps and like outlines. I just thought it was super cute. I don't know what drawed me in, drawed me in, drew me in. I don't own a pair of denim shorts that fits me, but I feel like it would look so cute with denim shorts. So we will see. Um, I can always try on a pair of denim shorts and leave them open like a psycho. Super cute. I feel like it'll fit and probably don't need to wear a bra, but I could easily too. So let's see. I'm excited. I may not have styled this 100% the best way. I look a little like Halloween, but I really like this top a lot. I love the white and the black, the like blocking colors. I think it's so fun. I feel like it's summer or winter. I could wear this with so many different options. It's long, so it's not cropped. So you could wear it over like a banded like denim, you know what I mean? Like, so it covers the band. It is great to tuck in. The medium, actually I got this in medium and it is a smidge looser than I would like it to be. So I am a true small, which is pretty impressive because Pink Blush does have all these other brands and usually sizing is so inconsistent. It's pretty consistent though. Everything has fit me in a small, but I really love the neckline. I love the straps. They're like the perfect length. They're not too long or too short, not adjustable, um, but they're nice and thick. This is probably breastfeeding friendly because it's super, super stretchy. Um, like I said, it is a medium. So if it was a small, I may be able to get away with no bra better because it'd be tighter, but I'm totally fine wearing what I'm wearing. I put these shorts on with it just because it's the first thing in my drawer that I thought would look good. I look like Halloween. It's very comfortable, stretchy, not too thick, not too thin, really good quality. Do you guys love it? This whole haul has been successful. When was the last time I had a successful haul? Like what? And Pink Blush being like really like having consistency across the brands. Guys, overall, this was like a total success. I am so impressed. I have to say the higher price tag at Pink Blush kind of makes sense, to be honest. I feel like the quality is really, really good. Like, I feel like this stuff will really, really last. And the styles are just so cute. They also have so many different styles, more fancy stuff, more casual stuff. So I feel like if you were thinking about it, maybe place an order. They do have sales pretty often, so I would look into that if you're curious. I'm gonna leave the link down below. I really wanna thank them for working with me. I knew it was a risk when I reached out. I'm not the biggest YouTuber, influencer, whatever you wanna call it. Um, so I was really lucky to have them agree um, and I love everything. So I would definitely shop from them again, just knowing that the quality is gonna be there. So thank you so much for watching. Um, everything will be mentioned down below or like listed or whatever. And subscribe if you wanna see more from me. I'm definitely gonna be doing more maternity hauls. I'm a clothing freak and being pregnant is a good excuse to buy more clothes. So if you want more videos on that, shopping during pregnancy and just pregnancy in general and all that good stuff um and just like you know regular stuff too please subscribe i'd really appreciate it and i'll see you guys soon bye